What is up guys and welcome back. So for today we have yet another Mortal Kombat 11 video and for today's video we have a new data mine that reveals a new DLC slot added to MK11. But anyways, with all that being said, be sure to smash that subscribe button if you haven't already. So with that being said, let's get right into the video. Alright guys, so like I said, there's been a new data mine, I believe this happened just yesterday, and this new data mine reveals a new DLC slot for MK11, which is pretty awesome because obviously that supports the possibility of us getting more DLC in the future like Combat Pack 3 or more characters or whatnot, maybe just Sector and Cyrex, we don't know. But anyways, here's the data mine, and as you can see, it was, uh, it was posted on Twitter, and this person said, Today, MKX got a new update. Yup, MKX, WTF. Also, another new MK11 DLC slot minutes ago, via Steam. So, this is the image they added, and like I've said before, I really don't know anything about data mining, but I guess that in this image, you can see that a new slot was added in MK11 for DLC, and the Honestly guys, that doesn't really mean we're getting like a new character or anything. That could be any type of downloadable content. But obviously us MK11 fans will keep our fingers crossed that it is some type of new character or something. And in terms of the other part of this data mine, which is really weird, is that MKX got an update. A game that's 5 years old just got an update yesterday. Like what? I don't, I don't know what NRS is planning, but clearly there's something going on behind the scenes at NRS that we're just not ready for. Like, that new DLC slot in MK11, an update to MKX, Combat Pack 2 just a few days away. Dude, I cannot wait for Combat Pack 2 to come out, because the day that comes out, there's going to be new data mines that will basically tell us almost everything coming to MK11. Unless they really did patch the data mines and it's unavailable. Hopefully it's not. But anyway guys, let's just keep our fingers crossed that we keep on getting DLC for MK11. And like always guys, that's the news for today, but be sure to leave your thoughts and opinions in the comment section down below. And for now, let's get to the comments of the day. So first up we have Rams, who would you like to be in MK11? Ash, Takeda, Smoke, or Deadpool, Reptile, or Kenshi? Between those two packs, if I have to pick one, uh, definitely Ash, Takeda, and Smoke. Just because I really want Smoke and Takeda. Although Kenshi, I've always wanted Kenshi, but Smoke and Takeda definitely beat Kenshi and Reptile. So I would go with Ash, Takeda, and Smoke. Next up we have, hey Rams, who are you going to play first, Rain, Melina, or Rambo? I'm gonna play. I'm gonna play first Rain, just because I've always, always loved Rain. He is easily in my top three favorite MK characters, so I'll definitely try to use Rain as my main first. Then I'm gonna use Melina because her gameplay looked beautiful, and on top of that, she looks really good in the game. So I'm gonna. I can't wait to use her. And then lastly, Rambo. Although Rambo does look cool and good and all, he just doesn't seem like my type of character in terms of of uh, gameplay. So I'll, I'll definitely use Rambo, don't get me wrong, but he'll probably be the one that I put the least amount of interest to. No offense to Sylvester Stallone, Rambo's an awesome character. And lastly we have, hey Rams, what would you think if Thanos appeared in any of the future combat packs? I think that would be awesome, but that's impossible. There's no way it's happening because Mortal Kombat is owned by, owned by Warner Bros. And Warner Bros. also owns DC. So there's no way that Warner Bros. is going to collaborate with Marvel since Warner Bros. is basically DC, so th there's no way that could happen. But for sure that in the future, NRS might get the title to some Marvel characters, but there's no way they're going to include them in an MK game or Injustice. There's no way. But anyway, guys, like always, let me know your thoughts on this in the comment section down below. Other than that, be sure to say subscribe for more videos just like this one. Thank you for watching, and peace.